made in Dundee. We used to be famous for the old jute jamming journalism. Now it's underage pregnancies, asbos, cocaine and vandalism. A city once blighted by tenement squalor, dubbed little Chicago full of gangsters and brawlers. At times looked down on by the rest of our nation, shot on and spat on, subjected to alienation. Don't believe us? Check out report in Scotland and the map for the weather. There's Edinburgh, Perth, Glasgow, Aberdeen and other others. But Dundee? Nah, it doesn't exist. What the fuck's it all about? Is there someone I've missed? Our city is alive just like it always was. Tax the shite gets back up again like it always has. But the world's finally beginning to open its eyes. Hey, wait a minute, Dundee's happening. Now there's a surprise. Has been happening for years. Ask boys like Sir Doogie Merton, Mike Mara, Chris Mara, and a whole list too long to mention. A great soul city where the music's aye been sweet. Legends of the local scene getting folk up on their feet. The mayhem of St Andrew and the mental wool and mill. In fact, performers of a class elite that would grace star studded bowls. And now in 2008, things are going from strength to strength. There's youthful dreams and hoosing schemes, guitars and creative pens. The view boys showed it could be done, they've inspired the generation. Writing about skag trendy streets and Drebber as urban nation. And what about the law? Nah, I know the boys in blue. Hellraiser, still got Friday to go, scheme boys through and through. There's a confidence in our tune, there's a swagger in our stride, there's a self-belief to grow and succeed and a love for the place we bide. It's where we're born and bred, where Abadie is a somebody, unashamed to shout and rant and spout, proud to say, made in Dundee.